The boat videos are back. Welcome to another video. You guys have been asking about it. You're like, Noah, where's the boat? We want to see some boat videos and we have it for you guys today to, to pretty much briefly explain what's gone on and why I haven't been filming on the boat. When I've been traveling a lot, it's hard for me to take out the boat because I'm doing a bunch of other things when I'm traveling. We're filming a lot, obviously, but it's usually with a lot of people. And if I take the boat, I might only use it for a day or two and it's not worth that on like a 14 day you know, trip. So yeah, I haven't been taking it out, I haven't been home. Finally got home, we're ready to put it in the water. I actually got my boy Fletcher behind the camera. What's going on, um, guys? And also, I actually have a problem with my boat, so come on back here. So when I plug my boat up, I pretty much, let me, let me show you guys. You guys that don't know, right here, to charge it, I'll plug it up right here, okay? Right here on my new Ranger. Show them that right there, Fletch. See, this is this this is showing the batteries charge and everything. This thing has been charged, it's been plugged up, but as you guys can tell, it has not charged. I mean, look at the trolling motor; it's all the way on red. Um, the cranking battery is literally almost about to be on red, and that is not good. I don't understand what's been going on with that. I don't, I don't think it's a battery problem. I think it's a charger problem. So that's something I'm going to look at. Um, and I want to bring the boat videos back, but the problem is, if I can't get the batteries charged after this video, I'm going to be in a hurting. Um, so I'm going to have to go toy around with that after today, after we go catch some fish. But if you guys are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell. Also, hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. Drop some video ideas down below. Today we're at the beautiful Lake Mare. You guys know that's like the only lake that I have around me rather than the rivers, and the rivers have been flooded. Speaking of rivers, we actually took, we actually took the boat out of there earlier today. Um, we realized how flooded it was. We stayed for a little bit. I caught a fish right away. Um, we're gonna roll those clips right now. Take this old stroker crawl, crawl. We're gonna try to catch us a. Ooh, that's a great way to start it. Try to catch us a hog today. I have to figure out how these fish are positioned up on all this stuff. Like I said, the water's just been. The water level's been weird. I've not been out here in a couple months, so I'm actually really excited. Got my boy Fletcher out here, and you know I want him to catch a good fish today. We're gonna figure him out. We're gonna start over here on the marsh side, and then work our way upriver later on in the day. I'm trying to get for like a big top water bite. So we're gonna flip around here, see if we can get something, see uh, see if these fish are gonna bite today. Water temp 71. They'll eat a top water today. This looks so good in this corner. There he is. Yep. Oh, he's not a bad one, dude. That's actually a really good river fish. There we go. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that right there. Look at that frog in his mouth. First river bass today. Beautiful markings. You see that, Fletcher? Just the color on those fish. That's actually not, not the prettiest one, but it's still a beautiful one. Right there, frog in the top of his mouth. I've not been out on the river in two months. We just got started. Catch a bass on a frog right away. That is exciting. Water temp is 71. They're gonna munch a top water good today if we get in the right spots. That is a beautiful Ogeechee bass right there. We're actually gonna throw this guy in the live well. We're gonna get a cool picture. It's Fletcher's first time on the river. We gotta make it an experience. I know, we're on him right away. I gotta smoke <laughs> one soon. Yeah, we're gonna catch him good today, bro. So yeah, the river's been flooded and that is the reason why I haven't really been out there, but we're gonna go ahead and put in Lake Mare. I'm hoping they're gonna bite a frog today. Hoping the fish are gonna be on bed. We're gonna look at the water temp and see what it is. I'm gonna guess it's around, you know, the 70, the, the low 70s. Um, and we should get on a good frog bite. 
and also, you know, if there's a lot of wind pushing out there, maybe a spinner bait, maybe some stuff of that sort. But let's go ahead and hit the water. Let's try to catch some fish. This one's gonna be good. Stay tuned. Let's get. Push me off as hard as you can. <laughs> Dive in head first. Yeah, Alan jumped in here one time about busted his from that same spot, yeah. Hoping they're gonna come up on a frog today. <gasps> oh, yep, that's a good one too. Not bad. Oh, he came off. He came off. That was horrible, man. I got bad hook set on. He's about two and a half pounds. I thought he was a solid when he came out of the water for it, I thought he was like a three. Oh man, that's a great sign though. Oh there's one. Got one. Got one. Fish on on the trap. First fish of the day. Yes, sir. This water's super clear right now. Came up and crushed this thing. Come here, bud. Come here, bud. On the boat. Yes, sir. That's my first official bass on the KTP boat. Stuck him right there on the trap. That nice, juicy crawl color. Just loving that crawl color in the springtime. Absolutely crushed it. Let's go ahead and get this sucker off. Good way to start the day, just getting a bass on the boat. No giant, but according to Noah, there are some absolute monsters in here. He's telling me a few tins have been caught out of here, but this is just a start, and I think we're going to smoke him today. Let's go ahead and get this girl back in the water, or we put him in the live well today. You want to? We can. If we can get a picture. Yeah, if you... Yeah, put her in. Change of plans, we're putting her in the live well. There you go, baby. Woo! Off in a hurry. Look at this, Fletcher. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, I should get hammered. That's exciting right there. They're, lock they're not locked on them, but there's definitely fish nearby. Oh, oh my. How about a four pounder? He never hit it. He came up and sucked it down how a big one does. You saw him, didn't you? I saw it. Yeah, I saw how about a four-pound fish? I, I don't understand how he came off. He must have not had it good because I stuck him. I mean, he didn't move. Gosh, that was a good bass. It's a good sign, though. I ain't going to keep. Yeah, they're biting. There's some up shallow near beds. Catch them on a frog. Can't complain. That just sucks. That was a four-pounder. Four Oh my gosh. Stay still. Just stay still. See a massive fish right there. I don't know where he went. Yeah, he was right there. Holy cow, dude. One of us needs to put on like a chatterbait or a spinnerbait. He's right there at the edge of that. There's a bunch of baby bass right here. Got him that time. That was another about four pounder, bro. I can't, I... I mean, what, I, how, I'm snapping him too, dude. He was running right at me, so that one just lost all pressure. 
That was ridiculous, man. I literally gave up freaking. That's two four pounders in that two that I lost earlier. That would have been 10 pounds of fish I just lost. On the frog, I actually had them hooked, you know. That's aggravating too, because they're eating it so good. I guess that's a good thing that we'll have more opportunities. That's just annoying. Those are two really good fish. Oh, dude, I spooked a fish off that bed. He's under me, he's under me. Come on, eat it. Dude, that's crazy. Um, I, I lost sight of him, but he, he when I landed there, he like ran off the bed and then got under my frog and never ate it. Oh yeah, he's up there, dude. I'm, I'm watching him right now. Watch this, dude. I'm gonna catch him on this Ned Rig if I can get it up there. He looks pretty good. Maybe two and a half, three pounds. He's up on the bed. Oh my gosh, look. I'm gonna catch this fish right now. Watch, he's about to eat it. He's about to eat it. Oh, he's falling it off. Just missed those two fish, but I just ran up on a fish on bed. I, I'm watching him right now, I can see him move. I just grabbed Fletcher's fluke. See if we can catch him. I'm watching him move. You might need to adjust that. Right there. Right there. There it's it is. Morning. Oh, she's gonna eat that. She sees us now, I rolled up too far. I can piss her off enough to get her to bite though. Let's find that sweet spot. So what we're about to do, we really need something with weight on it so I can sit there and hit the back of my rod and just really irritate the fish. So I'm actually gonna tie this Texas rig back on, see if we can hook this fish. I, I know I can catch him. This is the male, I don't know where the female went. The female was on it when I first pulled up. I just can't believe this fish is actually locked on. She's sitting dead on that bed right now. I'm sure you guys can see it through the lens, so this is gonna be exciting. We got a little stroker crawl on this Texas rig. We're about to snap this fish right here. You guys are about to watch it. Oh, dude, she literally put her nose on it. Are you seeing this on the camera? I hear, I can, I'll zoom in on it. <laughs> watch, we're gonna get it right here. What if I just let it sit? That's what I did with the iPhone that time. There it is. Did it snap? Yep. Look, she about to jump. Look at her, it's hanging out of her mouth. I feel so bad, that's horrible. That's horrible, man. I really wanna catch that fish. I might get the net, I wanna get, get that out of her mouth. Man, that's so, what is my luck? Look at it hanging out of her mouth, you see that? Oh, I do see it hanging. Dude, yeah. Well guys, that sucks right there. Are you sure? Dude, can I sneak up and net this fish? This would be the legendary clip of all time. She's under there, ain't she? Yeah, she's up under that that edge right there what if i netted this fish there's a baby turtle right there too oh it's, yeah it's in her mouth still dude let me get it out baby see her right there yeah the i do see her the bait's gone the hook isn't i can't believe that man i i gotta stop using this line guys i got some lines some new stuff that i haven't used and over the last month and a half i've literally snapped off more fish than i could even count and Let's get like, back to fishing. That irritates me. We spent so much time on that fish all to snap her off. That'll hurt your heart. Yeah, I've had so many people ask for my fish out here. Ask for your fish? Yeah. Say yeah. <laughs> Got him that time. Gosh, he came airborne for that. Gosh. Thank you for staying pinned. Of course, it's the small one. That's how it works, but I do not care. Frogfish is a frogfish. It's a beautiful one. That is a pretty guy. Nothing big. Like I said, we're going to throw these in live, but we're going to release them right when we're done. Thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. But. Me and Fletcher, it's Fletcher's first time on my boat. We gotta get a memorable pick. Hopefully we'll call those out with some big ones. 
I'll work that one a lot slower. And he like came up through that. Through the gun? Yeah, through the slot. That's how I thought one was gonna hit if he, there's one behind me right there. He threw your, oh, that was a good one. Oh no, that was my next cast. You know what, you know why I didn't hook that fish? You're not gonna believe it. Hopefully I caught it on GoPro. I threw my, look, my hooks weren't back. Dude, it's just all, this, this is all bad mistakes. You saw that fish, that was a freaking good one. Another good fish. Right when I barely moved it, dude, he hit it. I think that slow pop is what's gonna get these fish now. That was like next cast. I'm just like messing up today, man. Like, it's not even like, like some of them aren't my fault. Yeah. But that one right there, that was all, that was just stupidity on my part. I mean, that, that should have never happened. We're gonna close this place down soon. There's one. Ooh. This feels like a good one, Noah. Actually a big yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a good one. It's a good one. Dude, it's a good one, Noah. Dude, this is. I don't know. It's. Dude, that fish ain't moving. Dude. Yeah. There's no way that's. I think it's a fish, dude. You got your PB if that's a fish, dude. He's... It's moving. Dude, what dude, do you have? Dude, fish, what? Dude, Come on this side. Monster. Dude, this might be a monster. Oh my god. Dude. It's a turtle. Dude, it's the biggest turtle I've what ever seen. That? It was a turtle, dude. <laughs> <laughs> the turtle was bigger than that compartment, bro. Are you bro. kidding me? That was the biggest turtle I've ever Are seen in my life. Turtle? Yeah, you know like this big like sea oh turtles? God, dude. I it, saw the mass. I was like, I saw the mass. If you hadn't said it was a turtle, I would have thought that was... A 14 pound bass. No, I, dude, I saw the freak. It was seriously the size of that deck right there, like the where the kicking logo's on. <laughs> it was like that. My GoPro might have caught. Snapping turtle? Dude, giant turtle. That's the biggest turtle I've ever seen. I'm about to say, dude, if you, if you have a bass. It was like a fish, but it was, I was like, I was confused as to what it was. I was thinking it might be a turtle. Bro, that was crazy. I was like, if you have a freaking fish. You definitely have your PV. Like, there ain't even a question about that one. I was like... Dude, if this fish comes off because of that, he's still on. What happened? I gotta handline him. I gotta handline him. Oh, yes! <laughs> I just handlined that fish, dude. That is so small. Look at his tail. I just had to handline him, dude. I was not gonna let something stupid happen again. I was like, my it nodded around my eyelid when I hook set. Like, Fletcher, I got the worst luck out of anyone. This man's been with me a lot recently. Tell him how bad my luck's been. I mean, he's been snapping off. Just you name it, he's found a way to lose a fish. Look at that fish right there. See how short his tail is? That's so weird. We're just gonna get him back in the water. He ain't even worth putting in. Pretty guy though. It's a freaking giant. If that was a big one on that situation, you best to bet that thing would have pulled up. <laughs> I'll take him though. We're fi we're finally figuring out how these fish want it. That frog, I was working it a little too fast, walking it too much before. Now I'm slowing it down. That's what's triggering the bites. <laughs> nah. I gotta get that extra. Once I once I burn a few times or once, I'm good. Oh yeah. There it is. Dude, why is why do I hook set him so hard? Oh, I got him. He's not a bad one. He's in the slot. There you go. Well that right there guys, that's a solid two number. We can agree on that one. He look at the slop I had. <laughs> so much. Dude, dude, that is awesome right there. And he actually ate that frog good. See the other bites I have, they haven't been eating it like that. That's a freaking solid fish. Our best one today. If we could have had the fish that I missed earlier on the frog, we'd be good, but we have a lot of water to cover, and uh, this stuff is looking so good. We're gonna have a good time today, guys. We just gotta keep, keep chucking, keep our big bass energy flowing, and uh, keep catching big fish. We're gonna throw this guy in the live well and keep fishing. Oh, here old girl goes. Put her on the bigger side. Some angry fish in there. Some angry boys. We're gonna clean up the deck too. I'm gonna get all this back in the water. Got her on the boat. That's a good that's fish. The best one. That's the best one today. 
That is the Solid best one. Solid fish came up out of the muck. There we go. That muck right there, this fish just came right out of it. I mean, we can see in this water like clear as day, me and Noah with our glasses. And we're just looking at it and I was looking right at the bottom and I didn't see anything. And all of a sudden I just saw my thing disappear. She came right up out of the thickest of the thick stuff, crushed that little paddle tail. Beautiful, beautiful fish. That's the best one so far today. Let's go ahead and get her in the live well. That's number five. That's five. number five. That's number five. That's the bag. It's time to start culling soon. I don't know where the big in that. There's a good one. That's not the big one. That's a different one. Look at him looking at me. He sees us. Oh, yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, baby. Oh, oh. she didn't take it in. That was good. It's all right. Oh, I'm right on her nose. Look at that. Oh, oh. There she is. <laughs> yeah. Oh, not a bad one. Not a bad one. That is awesome. Yeah. That is so cool. Oh man, right off the bed. Look at that little Ned rig in the top of her mouth. That is a lot of fun. That is cool flush here. I can't believe she she put the his fluke in her mouth one time. We just she didn't grab. She just grabbed the back half of it. Yeah. There's another. You brought that fish about. I thought I was gonna eat you right That's there. That's where that. So guys, there's there's a bunch of beds down this bank. Got this thick, heavy grass right here. That's a solid two number. And um, we saw a big female with this one. I noticed it with my frog originally. And then, uh, you know, we caught the male right here. I don't know where the big female went. She's probably tucked under in all this slop. I am just glad we are catching them. It's a beautiful day today. Fish are biting. Slam it through this slop, big girl. I mean, there's a good bit of females that were, I mean, there's not, why is that? I jack him too hard, bro. And now my lines. I'm gonna literally Rattle lose this fish. TV, yeah. yeah. I probably lost him. Or is he still on? That's surprising. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, I'm wrapped around this thing. That's a little tiny guy. He did inhale it. <laughs> Gosh. I'm just every time I, I just end up hook setting and they fly in the air and wrap my freaking line around my eyelids. It's a pretty little guy, nothing big. Oh man, on the white frog, that's the first one on this one. I was telling Fletcher, we we're fishing all this grass, and then right when I put this frog on, it just kind of opens up to where I would rather throw a popping frog. I'm about to make an adjustment. We just came on this side, the clouds are getting out, the wind is picking up, and is going right against this grass line. I think it's time for me to whip this spinner bait out a little bit. I think this is going to produce a big bite if some of those you know fat females are pushed more off the bank i think you know this is what to pick up that big bite yes the frog i think is going to get some good fish but if those big females are pushed off a little bit more on this grass line feeding that would uh that would be awesome so we're gonna give it a shot we'll try it out for a little bit see if we can put together a big bag Really? Yeah. Want me to back up? Yeah. She's locked on. That's the male and the female. I'm trying not to get us too far up in this slot. One of them's actually really big. Look at them all. Dude, there's another one on bed up there. You see that? He's locked on too. There's another one right here, Fletcher, and there's like a five right here. You see this one? There's like a three chilling right here too. If I can, uh, what if, what if they just both came up and just, remember Same what we were talking about? Yeah. <laughs> Not even a double up, just like a. Double inhale. <laughs> oh. oh my God. That's like a two. Oh God, see him just chilling. Fish is locked on. Still there? 
Yeah. Oh. She might eat it. Yep. Yep. Came back for. Oh, beautiful fish. Look how clear that water is. Oh, yeah. That's not a bad fish at all. Solid two number. I got her. That's for sure. Light spinning tackle. See if you can catch that other one. There's some big ones over here. This is the ones that we were playing with earlier. I just pulled back about 45 minutes later. Just caught her right there on the Ned rig. Second bass today on the Ned rig. That's a beautiful one too. A little two number for her in the box. Trade her out. All right. That's the smallest one today. Still pretty fish. Get her right back in. There she goes. Go ahead. All right, guys, here are our best four. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I'm not going to be able to turn that off. Really good. All right, guys, we got these beautiful fish right here. These are our best four from today. Some solid two numbers, not bad. Yes, we missed some fish, but we still got some beautiful ones. We're actually in it. We were going to weigh them, but we're just going to get these guys back in the water. We want to get them safe and everything. Let's go ahead and get a release shot. All right, here we go. Always promote catch and release, boys. Pretty fish. Gorgeous. It's not a bad one right there. Some healthy bass right here. There they go. All swim off good. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell also. Hit the like button if you guys want to see some more boat videos. Let me know in the comment section down below, and we'll catch you guys in the next one.